Hello everybody, welcome to Corey Turner Talks Cars, and today we're going to talk about shoving your kneecaps through your eye sockets. And I wish I was kidding, but I'm being very, very honest. This is a safety video today, and we're going to try to keep you safe. I have family members and friends, and I bet you do too, hey, it might actually be you, who likes to drive around, well not drive around, but sit in the passenger seat, kick back, and rest their feet up on the dash. That seems harmless enough, right? Maybe you'll scratch the dash up with your shoes, but I'm like, what could possibly happen? Horrible things <laughs> could possibly happen. We're gonna look at an x-ray in just a moment of something terrible that happened to somebody who was riding around with their feet on the dash. And let's be honest, I think most people that do that, I don't do it, it kind of freaks me out, uh, but the people that do it, I think they have this feeling that if something bad happens, they'll just put their feet down real quick. So, but think about that. If that's the way you think, think about this for a second. You're riding along, you got your feet on the dash, you're playing on your phone, you're reading something, maybe you're just talking to the driver, and all of a sudden you're processing information of you see that a wreck's getting ready to happen, and the car is sliding in, is going to hit somebody. You have to process that information, stop doing whatever you're doing. Take your feet, get them off the dash safely in the footwell before. If you think you can do that, I hate to be mean, but you're, you can't do that. There is not going to be enough reaction time. If there is enough reaction time for you to do that, the driver has probably found a way to avoid the accident. And something else you have to remember, airbags deploy at 100 to 220 miles per hour. They are serious. Anything on the dash, when an airbag deploys, is going to be launched through your face. And if it happens to be your legs, ugh, let's just take a look. Let's see. I'm going to read you this story, so you're just going to have to bear with me as we're going to read this story. It says, surely you know that riding around with your feet on the dash is unsafe. We have talked about that. Uh, the x-ray that we're looking at here ugh, um, is, uh, is a... Uh, is horrible. It's the aftermath of a car crash. It's a young woman in Wells was riding with her feet up on the dash. One femur is snapped while one hip is broken in the socket and the other has been dislocated far from where it should be. And you can see that. Just look at that. That is, oh, that's horrific. That almost makes me sick to look at. That is, that is terrible. Um, X-ray mentions that Audrea Tatum on the X-ray uh, the Daily Mail's account, they did that, um, that Audrea Tatum of Chickamauga, Georgia, was permanently disabled in 2015 by a minor accident. Everyone else in the car received minor scratches and bruises, but the deploying airbag threw her foot into her face, breaking her nose, her femur, and her ankle in four places. Basically, my whole right side was broken, and it's simply because of my ignorance, Tatum said. I'm not Superman. I couldn't put my feet down in that period of time. So that one's not her x-ray. This is the x-ray that they're showing of the lady in Wales that has a dislocated hip and all that. But there's a lady named Tatum who actually was a nurse who after that she couldn't, uh, she could no longer be a nurse and do that. Um, the, the Chattanooga, Tennessee Fire Department issued a Facebook post a few years ago. It was shared and it said in part, airbags deploy at 100 to 220 miles per hour. If you ride with your feet on the dash and you're involved in an accident, the airbag may send your knees through your eye sockets. <sighs> okay, so next time you're riding around and you think about putting your feet up on the dash, just think for a second, what would it be like if that airbag deployed and basically you were folded in half with your kneecap shoved through your eye sockets. It's a horrible thing to think of. That x-ray is just, I don't know how you recover from that. I can't imagine how many years it would be to even attempt to recover from that. Even if you could, it was just all because you had your feet on the dash. So... I'm not want you not want you to be comfortable while you're riding around and enjoying your trip, but don't put your feet on the dash because man, bad things can happen. And it's happened. There's just two people in that story right there that it talks about it happening to, but it's happened to many, many more. So, do you ride around with your feet on the dash? Leave me a comment. I'll do my best to talk you out of it. Right? Have you heard of someone else being injured riding around with their feet on the dash? Be sure to share that with me. Uh, remember to like, comment, and share. Please share us with your friends. Remember. To subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're growing every day. 
I owe that to you. Thank you so much. So remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, and let's talk about cars tomorrow.